so much. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. 大家早上好。Everybody happy this morning? 今天早上大家都开心吗 ？I had a much better sleep. 我今天晚上，昨天晚上睡得非常好。I woke up at 4:30. 我早上四点半起来。And I looked at the clock, and I saw it was 4:30, and I rolled over, and I woke up at 7. 啊，那么起来之后呢，我看还早了，四点半，我又再倒回去睡了，一起来就七点钟了。So you better watch out, because I feel refreshed. 哇，你们要小心了，因为今天我觉得我充电了啦。Did everyone have a good day yesterday? 昨晚上大家有个美好的一天吗 ？Three of you. <laughs> Three of them had a good day. Oh, 只有三个人有美好的一天是吗 ？I I think I need to preach the same message again. Then. 这样我要再重复昨天讲的信息了啦。Did you have a good day yesterday? 昨晚上你们过得好吗 ？Okay, we can do a different message. 那这样我今天可以讲另外信息了。Thank you, thank you for having me. 谢谢你们邀请我来。Thank you, Pastor He. 谢谢许牧师。How many of you appreciate Pastor He? 有多少人很感激许牧师啊？ Thank you so much. Thank you. I I I know I said this yesterday, but you're not my translator today. Ah, I yesterday I just told you, but today is not my translator. So I'll say it again. Then I'll say it again. Then I'll say it again. Bethel Church and myself are very proud of Pastor He. So then, Bethel Church and me are very proud of Pastor He. So then, Bethel Church and me are very proud of Pastor He. So then, Bethel Church and me are very proud of Pastor He. So then, Bethel Church and me are very proud of Pastor He. And you have you have all of our support. We are right behind you. 那么你拥有我们所有伯特利和我的支持。I I want to. Uh, the, I I already told you this yesterday. 昨晚上我啊，昨天我已经告诉你了。But one of the greatest passions I have is actually getting you free. 其中我一个很最大的热忱呢，是让你们得自由。In Galatians five, it says. For freedom's sake, he set you free. 我将来读第五章说，因着自由使你得释放。The freer that you become, the more powerful you'll be. 你越有自由，你就越有能力。I I just I I don't like hanging out with Pharisees. 我不喜欢和这所谓的法利赛人啊在一起的哈。Because Pharisees love to tell you why the power of God shouldn't flow. 法利赛人呢很喜欢告诉你为什么这个大能不能涌流出来。Pharisees are generally religious people that are in so much bondage to religion. 那么呢，法利赛人呢，通常都都是大部分都被那个宗教的灵里面捆绑着。And Jesus is not religious. He is a he is a loving, free father. 那么呢，耶稣呢，不是很在宗教的这个捆绑的里面，他是一个很喜爱自由的一一位天父。See the father. The father can't be loving and controlling at the same time. 怎么天父不可能又爱你，然后又又控制你的 ？Because loving and controlling don't go together. 因为爱和控制是不可能在一起的。And I'm going to talk a little bit about that more in the next session. 啊，这有关这主题呢，等下我下一堂会讲。But my heart this morning is that I would just make you just. That we would unlock you and just make you a little more free. 我们今天早上呢，我是希望能够更多的替你们解开一些啊思维的捆绑，让你们更有自由。I I woke up I woke up this morning not really sure what I was gonna when I went to bed I didn't know what I was gonna share on today. 今天早上我起来呢，我还在想要怎么样可以比较分享什么，向你们分享什么。And I woke up and I had two very clear thoughts in my head. 就我起来呢，有在我头脑海里面有两个很清楚的想法。They were the only two clear thoughts I had in my head. But 当时只有两种想，两个想法在我脑海里面。So that's what I I want to share with you this morning. 就今天早早上向你们分享的。There's something there's something really powerful about walking in the power of God and seeing lives set free and lives healed. 这个很重要。当我们行在超自然里面，能够使那个捆绑的得自由、得释放。But in Luke 10 verse 17. 路加福音十章十七节。It says that the the seventy returned to Jesus with joy. Seventeen. Seventy. 呃，七十个回来，带着欢喜快乐回来，耶稣那里。And they say, Jesus, even the demons were subject to your name. 他说，啊
See, the 70 of them, they were out there changing the world. That they were seeing the power of God displayed through them. And Jesus turns to them and he says, Nevertheless, do not rejoice in this. That the, that the demons are subject to you. But rejoice that your names are written in heaven. See, I want to talk to you a little bit this morning about living forgiven. About living in freedom. Because the freer you get, the more powerful you will be. In Psalm 103, verse 3, it says, Who forgives all your sins and heals all your diseases. Who, he's, sorry, it says, He forgives your sins and heals you your diseases. In 1 Corinthians 15, verse 3, it says, it says, for what I received, I passed on to you of first importance. That Jesus died for your sins. Now, I, I do believe that the forgiveness of sin and the healing of our diseases is synonymous. That there is no separation between them. It's the same Jesus. It's the same time. It's the same cross. It's the same beating. It's the same crucifixion. That the forgiveness of sin and the healing of our diseases are one and the same. But it's interesting that Jesus says that the forgiveness of our sins is of first importance. In, in Luke 15, uh, let me rephrase that. There's many times as Christians that we're more conscious of our broken fellowship than then we're more sorry, we're more conscious of our broken fellowship with God than the fact that all of our sins have been forgiven. There's many believers that I meet that are more like the Pharisees. And, and they don't understand how forgiven they are. And because they don't know how forgiven they are, they fail to see the power of God manifest through their life. That we, we end up in life, I touched on this yesterday, we have more of a sin consciousness than a righteousness consciousness. When, when I was a child, I, I went to a denominational church. I was raised in religion. And every year we went to a, a Sunday school camp. Well, it was a church camp. But they put the kids over here and the adults in another room. And every year they did a skit, like a play. And in the play, uh, they, they always needed a devil. They needed a God, God, son, and they needed a person. They always made me the devil. 
I, I wanted to be God. <laughs> But they made me the devil every year. So 每年要叫我扮魔鬼 And and they they would sit they would sit a person on a chair. 他们把一个人坐在那个人坐在椅子上 And the person that they and then God would be talking to the person. 啊，那那个扮演神的就向这个人一直说话 And then the person would tell a lie. 那么那那那这个人就会说谎 And the devil would run in. 那么魔鬼就跑进来 Me. 那就是我了 And and he would put. Uh, he would build a brick wall between the person and God. Ah, this devil will start to build walls to protect man and God. The fellowship would be broken. So, man and God's relationship will start to fall. The fellowship would be broken. So, man and God's relationship will start to fall. The fellowship would be broken. So, man and God's relationship will start to fall. The fellowship would be broken. So, man and God's relationship will start to fall. The fellowship would be broken. So, man and God's relationship will start to fall. The fellowship would be broken. So, man and God's relationship will I would like to propose to you that that is religion. 我要告诉你，这一个是宗教。See how many conditions are there to the unconditional love of the Father. 那么多少的条件使到那无条件的爱不能够进入到我们里面 ？And the, and when when、uh, when I repented, when I when I said I was sorry. 当我悔改说，神啊，你饶恕我的话的时候 it, ，It was only then that the wall would be broken down. 就那个时候呢，一球老鼠，整个的墙就开始倒塌。And then God can hear me again. 然后手就神呢，就可以开始听我讲话。I'd like to suggest to you that that is religion at the worst degree. 我要跟你说，这样的理念是宗教化的。Because I have a father of unconditional love. 因为我拥有一个无条件的爱的天赋。My father doesn't break fellowship with me. 我的天赋绝对不会和我断绝关系的。See in Psalm 102. 诗篇一百零二篇。It says, "Forget not all of all of his benefits." Hold on, forget not all his benefits. Oh, 那么不要忘记所有的恩典 Who forgives you all your sin? 不要忘记那那给你恩典的那饶恕你的那一位 And he heals you of all your disease. 然后他医治你所有的疾病 I I want you to turn with me in the Bible. 我要你跟我一起翻开圣经 Did you bring your Bible? 有带圣经来吗 Let me see it. 让我看看你的圣经 Let me see the paper Bibles. Look, you have the Bible. Come on, I'm a paper man. You know what? I want to hear. I want to hear it. I want to hear it. Come on, I want to hear. I want to hear it. 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 I want my kids to say, "That's my dad's Bible." I I I want my kids to say, "This is my dad's Bible." I don't want them walking around saying, "That's my dad's iPad." I don't want my kids to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want them to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want my kids to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want them to say, "This is this was my father's preaching Bible." I don't want my kids to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want them to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want my kids to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want them to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want my kids to say, "This is my dad's iPad." I don't want my kids to say, "This is my dad's iPad." But this is my preaching Bible. 但是这是我讲到用的圣经。Paper 是用纸做到的。So let me see your paper Bible. 让我看看你用纸的圣经。Oh my goodness. 哎，糟糕了。Let me see your electronic Bible. 让我看你的电子圣经。Now put your hand up if you didn't bring your Bible. 那些没有带圣经的举手，完全没有带的。I I am not here to condemn you. 啊，我不来不是定你们的罪哈。Because I want to talk to you this morning about walking free from condemnation. I want to tell you to get out of that guilty feeling and get out of that free will. I'll condemn you first, and then I'll fix you later. I first condemn you, then I will fix you. In the book of、uh, Mark,、uh, Luke, 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 That he was teaching. Ah, Jesus, that that 时候在安息日里面，他在教导。And there were Pharisees and teachers of the law sitting by. 那么当时有法利赛人坐在一边。Who had come out of every town of Galilee, Judea, and Jerusalem. 是从加利利啊，那那是一带来的。And the power of the Lord was present to heal them. 那么神的大能彰显来医治，他同在彰显来医治。See the power of the Lord was present. 那么呢啊 ，power of the Lord， 神的能力彰显的 power of the Lord. I would like to suggest to you. 我想向你说的是 
that the power of the Lord to heal is always present. 那么神的大能呃彰显呢，一一直都在同在里面的。That wherever you go， 就是说无论你去到哪里 ，because we are at union with Him， 因为我们和他合一在一起。The power of the Lord is present to heal. 神的大能就会同在彰显出来呢，来医治。Now the question would be. 那么问题是 ，is why don't we always see the power of God displayed if the power of the Lord is always present? 那么呢，为什么呢？我们常常看见呢，在神的同在里面，竟然有神的同在没有彰显他的大能。See, it's an interesting story because we know that the power of the Lord was present to heal. 那么很奇妙的，就是看到神的大能彰显来医治。But the Pharisees were the ones that were that were actually sitting in the presence of the power of the Lord. 那么法利赛人呢，是在那个当时的神的大能的同在的里面的哦。Now, if the power of the Lord was present to heal, 如果神的大能彰显就是要医治的话 ，then in this story, how many people got healed? 那么就在在在这段事迹里面呢，有多少人得医治了呢？ One, 一个人 because the Pharisees were the ones that missed the power of the Lord. 法利赛人就是那位错过了神的大能的那那个人 Because the power is always present. 因为神的大能永远同在在那里的 The question is, is how aware are you of the power of the Lord? 那么就是问题是在你那个环环境里面的你是在怎样的一个处境当中 See, the the story goes on to say that only one got healed. 在故事里面呢，看到了只有一个人得医治。And the Bible says， 圣经说 ，It says as you go， 当你去出去的时候 ，Say that the kingdom of heaven is at hand， 说天国已经在啊我们的眼前了。Heal the sick， cleanse the lepers， raise the dead， and cast out demons。就说你出去啊，医治病人，把魔鬼赶出去，然后使呃被囚的得释放。Freely you have received， freely give。白白的得到自由，你就白白的释放那个那个自由。I I would like to suggest that some people don't walk in the power of God because they don't know that it's free. 那么很多人呢不能够啊彰显神的大能，因为他们没有得到那个自由。See the greater revelation I get of the centrality of Jesus in my life. 那么我当当我在啊在在灵里面能够更加的了解到耶稣这个，耶稣是我的中心之后。The more I walk in power, 我就能够行在更大的大能里面。See, it's one thing for God to be giving; He's always the giving God. 你要记得，我们他是一个常常愿意给予的那一位。But it's another thing for us to know how to receive. 那么是我们需要知道我们要如何去领受。And sometimes, as Christians, 有时候呢，成为一个基督徒呢 ，we we become so busy. Trying to behave for his blessing. 我们有时候呢，为了要守所谓的行为来得到他的祝福。That we fail to receive. 结果我们结果没有领受到。Because the blessing of the Lord doesn't come from you behaving for your blessing. It comes from you recognizing that it's the unmerited favor of God. 我们因为领受这个祝福，不是因为你行了什么的行为，而是因为行了啊这个神的恩惠恩典来赐给你的。There's there's a story in Matthew 15. 1915. Matthew. Oh, Matthew, Matthew 15. Matthew 福音十五章 And a Gentile woman comes to Jesus and she cries out. 一个外邦人的妇女来到耶稣面前，她呼叫耶稣 Son of David. 她说大卫之子啊 Have mercy on me, for my daughter is severely demon possessed. 那么来怜悯我啊，因为我的女儿被魔鬼的啊所欺压压得很惨啊。But the very next verse says that Jesus answered her not a word. 那么耶稣在下一节却说没有回答他一个他的他所求的。So so one could one might say that Jesus wanted to see how desperate she was. 啊，有人认为呢是要看这个妇女有多的绝望。Desperation is not what moves the heart of God. 绝望是不。啊，不会感动上帝做做行他的大能的。If it was desperation that got us healed, we'd all be healed. 耶稣不不因为你绝望才来让你死得医治的。
So it's not desperation that moves God. So perhaps we could say, well, Jesus never heard the woman. But we know that that's not true either. Because Jesus heard the woman. Because the next verse is the proof of that. That the disciples say, shall we send her away? For she cries out after us. And I, Jesus never healed the woman. Because she didn't know it was free. And I believe that the religion has damaged. And will stop the power of the Lord flowing. Because religion wants you to think that you need to earn it. Religion wants you to think that you need to achieve it. That you need to behave yourself into a miracle. See, the woman, she cries out, Son of David, have mercy on me. And he answers her not a word. So why then did he not answer her a word? I believe that he never answered her a word. Because she addresses Jesus as the son of David. You can't address Jesus as the son of David as a Gentile. You can only address him as the son of David if you're a Jew. So therefore, she came to Jesus, pretending that she was somebody that she wasn't to get something that she wanted. So I think her thought process process was this. If I can. I know that he came to heal the Jews. So I'm going to pretend to be a Jew. Because if I can pretend to be a Jew, I'm going to get healed. See, that's most of the church today. Is that we're coming to Jesus based on our merits, not on His merits? We're coming to Jesus based on our works, our merits, and what we think we've earned. And, and it wasn't until the lady comes to Jesus and she falls before him and she worships him. And she says, Lord, help me. It is in that place that the power of the Lord flowed. Because coming to Jesus just as we are, I believe is the greatest act of humility that we could display. Not coming based on what I've earned and what I think I deserve. See, the power of the Lord is always present. I, I truly believe it. That He is always the power is always flowing from the cross. But it comes down to our ability, can we receive it? See, as a church, we, we have to learn to uh, harness the power of God. 
How, how many of you have heard of Benjamin Franklin? No one? Benjamin Franklin invented electricity. Sorry? He invented electricity. Oh, so that's a fat Benjamin Franklin invented electricity in 1752. 1752, And he, he invented it by flying a kite. And the electricity hit the kite. So he discovered electricity. But he didn't know what to do with electricity. Because he hadn't learned to harness the power that was available. It wasn't until 1879 when Thomas Edison came along a hundred and thirty years later where the power was available but they hadn't learned how to receive. So 130 years go by where the power was available but they didn't know how to harness it. And Thomas Edison comes along and he he uh, learns to harness the power of God and he creates, uh, sorry, the power and he creates a light bulb. So See, the potential was there, but they never harnessed it. And I believe it's the same in the church. That the power of God is always present. But it's religion that would tell you you don't deserve it, you can't do that, and gives you every reason why we shouldn't receive it. And as a body of Christ, we need to change the way that we think. Because the power is always flowing from the cross. It is always available. We need to learn how to receive. Because we, as we receive, that we become healed. And we can take the power of God to a city, to a country that so needs a revival of a healing movement of God. But the Pharisees are going to give you every reason why you shouldn't. We need power. I tell you, it is not, it is not the, if, you, if we are not demonstrating power, we are not demonstrating the full gospel. We need power. We need a healing revolution in the church. We need the church to awaken. That the power of God is there and we can harness it and we can have it in our lives right now. We need to stop creating excuses as to why we don't see miracles. And we need to begin to align our life to the person of Jesus Christ. I tell you, I have never felt so convinced we need a healing movement. We need to stop treating sickness like it's a blessing from the Lord. It is not a blessing from the Lord. It is an oppression from the pit of hell. And God is looking for a generation that would rise up 
that would say, "I'm going to harness this power of God." And stop making excuses as to why the power of God does not flow through you. Because we're acting like Pharisees. I'm not talking about this church. I'm talking about the church down the road. If you're from that one, I didn't mean that one either. I meant the other one. See, I, I don't want to miss the power of God. And the way that I can walk freely into the power of God is, is by understanding that I am forgiven. That forgiveness of sins and the healing of my diseases were one belt across the back of Jesus. That is the same cross. It is the same Jesus. It is the same day. That we cannot pull those two things apart. See, let's go back to our story in Luke 5. It says that the power of the Lord was present. But only one got healed. The power of the Lord was present. I tell you, this is a disturbing story for me. Because the power of the Lord is always with us as believers, but it comes down to do you recognize it? If you don't know that you are forgiven, how can you ever walk in the power of God? See, only one person got healed in that story. And it was the story of the crippled man that was lowered down through the roof. And Jesus goes up to that young man. He does not say, Son, take up your bed and walk. He goes to that man and he says, Son, your sins are forgiven you. Take up your bed and walk. Therefore, I would like to propose to you that we will ever only walk in the power of God to the extent that we know we're forgiven. And too many Christians, they don't know that they're forgiven and it blocks the power of God flowing through them. I tell you, it is time for a gospel revolution. It is time that we put the gospel back in church. That we start living forgiven. See how forgiven do you think that you are? I think that not living forgiven will block the power of God flowing through you. We need to know how much we're forgiven. See, I, I truly do believe. See, Jesus says to that man, Son, your sins are forgiven. That we can only receive the full manifestation of healing when we know how much we're forgiven. And we can only display the power of God through us by knowing how much we're forgiven. See, isn't it interesting that most Christians around the world are the most miserable people on the face of the earth that I've ever met. See, because Jesus didn't die just for your sickness and your sin. He died to your guilt 
your condemnation and your shame. He also is for your self-pity, self-condemnation, and guilt. But because we're not preaching the gospel, because we're always preaching the gospel. Christians are walking around miserable. 那么基督徒呢就在地上呢活得很糟糕。Because they put their carrying shame and condemnation and guilt. 因为他们期待着那个所谓的羞耻感、内内疚感、定罪感。I I am on TV sometimes. 有时候我会在啊电电台啊电视台。And a a, a lady was watching. 啊，有一个一个姐妹跟姐妹在看看这个电视节目。And she called me on my phone. 啊，就打我的电话。And she said, Chris. 她说 ，Chris。She said, "You've put on a little bit of weight." Oh, you're like, uh, a little, a little pound, lah. And she said, "Shame on you." Oh, you really feel ashamed. I stopped her and I said, "I'm sorry, but I don't do shame." Oh, you really feel ashamed. I stopped her and I said, "I'm sorry, but I don't do shame." Oh, you really feel ashamed. I stopped her and I said, "I'm sorry, but I don't do shame." Oh, you really feel ashamed. I stopped her and I said, "I'm sorry, but I don't do shame." Oh, you really feel ashamed. There's only one person that I would allow to say that to me. <laughs> 只有一个人我允许他跟我这样子讲。Even though I didn't receive it. 呃，甚至他讲到了，我也不完全的接受。It was my 95-year-old grandma. 就是那我九十五岁的婆婆。She she turned 95 on Monday. 哇，星期一她就九十五岁了。See, as a body. 那么成为啊基督的身体。I think that we've done a poorly, a a very bad job. 我们做了个很糟糕的工作。It's saying. Shame on you! Oh, you should feel guilty. Shame upon you! Oh, shame! You really feel guilty. You should 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 feel guilty. Powerful because we're carrying something upon our backs that Jesus took upon His. Why do we not be able to live in the world? Why do we not be able to live in the world? Because we're carrying the weight of the cross that Jesus took upon Him. And the greater freedom that I come into, 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 and the greater And we say, "Well, welcome to the kingdom." 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 The gospel is is that your sins have been forgiven. 福音是说你的罪已经得赦免了。From the day that you were born until the day that you die. 从你出世到你死那一天。That he remembers our sins no more. 他不再纪念我们的罪了。See what would it look like if we started to live forgiven? 所以如果你看看想想，如果我们一直看我们是被饶恕、被赦免的，会怎样 ？And we stop carrying guilt. Shame and condemnation around with us for things that God has long, long, long forgiven you for. Ah, 如果我们一直我们不再期待那些所谓的内疚、定罪、羞耻感，是耶稣在早两千年已经为我们担当的，完全赦免了。And now we wonder why we fail to harness the power of God. 那为什么现在我们不能够拥戴神的大能呢 ？Because we don't think that we're worthy. 因为我们觉得我们不配啊。That because you don't think that you're worthy, because you're carrying guilt, shame, and condemnation for something that He took upon Himself. Because you always think that you're worthy, because you're carrying guilt, shame, and condemnation for something that He took upon Himself. Because you always think that you're worthy, because you're carrying guilt, shame, and condemnation for something that He took upon Himself. I think that it's killing the church. This is killing the church. I think that it's totally blocking the power of God for us to live forgiven. I think that it is totally blocking the power of God flowing through us. This is totally blocking the power of God flowing through us. This is totally blocking the power of God flowing through us. This is totally blocking the power of God flowing through us. Because if Jesus died to your guilt, your condemnation, and your shame, why are you carrying it? So Jesus is in this situation, when he puts on this kind of guilt, shame, and condemnation, why do you carry these feelings? And 
we we wonder why the church is so sick. So, 我们在想为什么教会这么软弱。I'd like to tell you why I think the church is so sick. 我要告诉你为什么教会总觉得自己很软弱。Because science will tell you that if you carry guilt and condemnation and shame, you will be sick. 因为呢。科学医学已经告诉我们，如果你一直带着内疚、定罪、羞耻感，你一定会生病。Because shame will bring you to an end, it will make you sick. 因为羞耻感会带到最后，你的病就从身体爆发出来。Because it is your way of saying I have done wrong and somebody has to pay for this. 因为你是对自己说，我就做错了，必须要有人付上代价。So I am going to punish myself with shame, guilt, and condemnation. Because somebody has to pay for what I did wrong. Because I did wrong, so I always have this guilt, shame, condemnation to punish myself. Because I have to pay for what I did wrong. Well, if you need to pay for what you did wrong, I guess that Jesus never needed to go to the cross. So if you can pay for what you did wrong, Jesus never needed to go to the cross. So if you can pay for what you did wrong, Jesus never needed to go to the cross. So if you can pay for what you did wrong, Jesus never needed to go to the cross. So if you can pay for what you did wrong, Jesus never needed to go to the cross. I don't do guilt, shame, and condemnation. 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 I don't do We have to recognize that we need to recognize that you are forgiven and start walking forgiven. You 必须要认同自己已经被赦免，你必须要开始行在自由里。Two weeks ago, I was in Australia. 两个星期前我在澳洲。And a lady came up to me. 一个姐妹走上来。She said, "Um, her friend brought her." 啊，是她朋友带她来的。She said, "Can you pray for my friend?" 你可以为我朋友祷告吗 ？She has severe pain in her leg for like ten years. 她的那脚疼痛大概有十年了。And I said, "Of course I can." I said, "Of course I can." Now the lady's looking down, like. That 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 姐妹就这样子低住头 I said, "Look at me." Ah, 看住我，我看她这样，她就这样子，看到一下又低回，又低回头。Look at me. 看我，她又低上低着头，啊，又低下头。And she goes, "It's okay. Go and find somebody else to pray for." 我讲，哦，没问题啦，你找别人为你祷告。And I said, "Why?" 哦，她她那个姐妹说，啊，不不要紧了，我找别人为我祷告。我就问她为什么 ？Because there's people. That need God's power more than me. Because you, there's more. They need. Oh, because there are more people who need prayer than me. So they feel they don't need prayer. I don't want to pray for Christmas. They say, "You pray for others. There are more people who need prayer." I said, "Look at me." 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 That there's only so much anointing to go around, and it's not for you today. You say, "God's power is only for a few people. It's not for everyone." I said, "Woman." I said, "Woman." You are believing a lie. You are believing a lie. The power of the Lord is present. God's power is present. And she said,、oh, "It's okay." No, 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 no. I said, "It's not okay. Listen to me." No, this is not okay. You have to listen to me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. <laughs> Look at my eyes. Look at my eyes. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present to heal you. I said the power of the Lord is present I said, "You need to get over yourself." You 必须要开始啊，胜过自己了。I'm not the greatest pastor. 那我不是最伟大的牧师了。Pastor, he would never say that. 啊，许牧师不会这样子讲了。I said, "You need to get over yourself." 你必须要开始胜过自己。Because it's the blood of Jesus that made you worthy. 因为耶稣的宝血使你配得。See, you don't think that you're worthy of healing because you're carrying guilt. Shame and condemnation. Because you just feel that you are not worthy of healing. Because you are carrying guilt, shame, and condemnation in your heart. Because you don't know how much you are forgiven. 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 You are forgiven. I said, "You are worthy because of the blood of Jesus. You are forgiven." I said, "You are worthy because of the blood of Jesus. You are forgiven." I said, "You are worthy because of the blood of Jesus. You are forgiven." I said, "You are worthy because of the blood of Jesus. You are forgiven." I said, "You are worthy because of the blood of Jesus. You are forgiven." I said,
I, I think she was a little shocked. <laughs> 开始被还有一种被被惊惊到惊惊吓到了。So now let's get you healed. 那么来，现在你要得医治了。Ten years of pain was gone in two seconds. 那么十年的痛，两秒钟搞定了。See how forgiven do you think you are? 所以你看你自己有多被赦免了呢 ？Or are you carrying guilt, shame, and condemnation for things that the Lord is like long, long, long forgotten? 还是你已经还在期待着这些所谓的定罪感、内疚感，是耶稣已经是两千天为你担了的呢 ？I I have a good friend， 我一个好朋友 ，and he and he made a mess in ministry about twenty five years ago。他二十五年前，啊，师傅的乱七八糟，二十五年前。I I I it doesn't matter what he did, he made a mess。总之啊，不不不问题，他做过什么了，总之是搞到乱七八糟了。And twenty five years on to this day。所以。二十五年，一直到二十五年那一二十五年后那一天 ，He still punishes himself for his mistake。他一直惩罚自己，因为他觉得他做错了。Because we hold on to this mentality, somebody has to pay for what I did wrong。因为我们一直有这种思维，就是有人做错，必须要有人受惩罚。And we wonder why he's always battling with sickness and his health。所以就就是为什么他一直有在病患里面。Now I I want I want to say something that's going to be a little controversial. Ah, 我要跟你讲一个有有比较对质的那那个那些啊信息哈。And I I'm okay with controversy. Ah, 彼此对质，我对我讲是 OK 的哈。I it really doesn't bother me. Ah, 不会影响我的。Because I just love to upset the Pharisees. 因为我很喜欢冒犯法利赛人啊。So if you get if you get really upset with me, 如果你你看到我你很不爽的话 ，maybe you should ask yourself, am I a Pharisee? 你就可以问自己，我是不是法利赛人呢 ？I love you. 我很爱你们的哦。I I'm trying to challenge your thinking. 我现在要挑战你的思想。Many of us don't live forgiven. 很多人没有活在被赦免的里面。We wonder why we don't see the power of God displayed. 所以就是为什么神的大能没有彰显。Because we're carrying guilt, shame, and condemnation. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the power of the cross. Because we don't understand the I repent because I am forgiven. 我悔改是因为我先得赦免。I cannot be any more forgiven than the day I I came to Jesus. 那么呢，我来到耶稣的面前，我的所有的一切已经得赦免了。Because if I say I'm not forgiven, 因为如果我说我没有得赦免 ，for what I've done wrong， 我为了我所做错的。Then I'm actually saying, Jesus, the blood, the price that you paid wasn't enough. 那么就等于你在说，是耶稣在十字架上所付的代价还不够。I've done something so bad. 我做了很糟糕的坏事。And your blood is okay for that person over there. 啊，耶稣，你付的宝血可能只给那些小罪啊，没有问题啦。But not for me. 啊，对我来讲，不不能。Because I'm just, I'm, 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 un, I'm unworthy. What you really just said is, your blood is not enough for me. 你在说耶稣的宝血还不足够来赦免你。See, I I didn't say, please hear this. 听听清楚哈。Before you turn off. 啊啊，在你还没有关机之前听清楚。I I didn't say I don't agree in repentance. 我没有说我不认同悔改哈。But what is repentance? 什什么是悔改 ？See, we think repentance is like. 我认为悔改就是哭啊哭啊，啊，一直拿情绪骂。We think that repentance is is sorrow。我们觉得悔改是好像很悲哀的。That that's not the definition of repentance。这个不是悔改的定义啊。Repentance is changing our mindset。悔改是改变你的思路。We were going this way。我们是本来这个方向的。And we're now going this way。现在我们转过去另一个方向。See, the Father is not condemning you。你知道天父不是定你的罪。He doesn't want you to carry guilt, shame, and condemnation. 天父不要让你一直携带着内疚、定罪跟羞耻。The the woman was caught 
there was a woman that was caught in the act of adultery. 那么有个妇女被抓到犯了奸淫的罪。And she, the Pharisees bring it to Jesus. 法利赛人把她带到耶稣面前。And the Pharisees say, Jesus, this woman was caught in the very act of adultery. 那么法利赛人就跟耶稣说，这个妇女是所谓的抓奸在床。She's not accused. She's. 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 当场抓到的，不是诬赖他的哈。And Jesus says， 那耶稣说 ，Well let him who is without sin cast the first stone。那么让那些觉得自己没有罪的先丢第一颗石头。And the Bible tells us that that one by one， 那么圣经告诉我们，一个一个的离开。The Pharisees drop their stones。法利赛人啊，丢下他手上的石头。And walk away。那就走开了。Perhaps。可能。Just perhaps, 可能哈。The first Pharisee that dropped his stone. 第一个丢开他手上的石头那一个法利赛人。Perhaps before he walked away, he had to pull his pants up. 他走开之前必须要把裤子拉开来走开哈。啊，穿上啊，不 ，OK。I would like to see. I I know this is not biblical. I'm just. Making observation. Uh, 我知道，当然这个不是完全啊， uh, 圣经里面讲的，这是我是一直探讨，一直在想哦。That perhaps is 描述出来哈、哦。For that for that woman to be caught in the very act. 因为你要抓到一个妇女，真的是在场现场抓到的话。They were either peeping on her. 她应该是有偷窃，他们就偷看他们。Or they were her. They were the man. 或者她自己本身就是那男人。And so one by one they drop their stones. 所以圣经说，一个一个的放下手上的石头就离开了。And they they walk away. 他们就走开了。And Jesus he turns to the woman. 然后耶稣就对着这个妇女说。And he says, woman. 然后女人啊。He says, where are those that condemn you? 那些告你的人在哪里啦 ？Where are those that accuse you? 那些要告你的、诬赖你的人在哪里了 ？Why did he want her? Why did he ask her the question? Because he wanted her to declare it out of her mouth. Because he wanted her to declare it out of her mouth. Because he wanted her to declare Now, now, please hear this. Ah, 听听清楚哈。Neither do I. 我也 go and sin no more. 然后不要再去犯罪。Now, if we don't know the heart of the gospel of what Jesus took upon Himself at the cross. 那么如果你不明白耶稣在十字架上所被上的那个福音。And you're a Pharisee. 你就是法利赛人。如果你是法利赛人。You love to teach. Go and sin no more. 你常常会这样讲。出去吧，不要再犯罪了。You were caught in adultery. 你是当场抓到的哦。Now go and sin no more. 出去，不要再犯罪了。And I'm going to punish you if you do it again. 如果你再做的话，就惩罚你了。Go and sin no more. 出去，不要再犯罪了。See, Christianity is not a sin management program. 那么呢，啊，基督教呢，不再是，不是在管理罪恶而已。What gives power to the woman going and sinning no more? 什么能力叫那个女人不再犯罪呢？ It's knowing that he is not condemning you. 是知道他不再定我们的罪了。The Father is not condemning you for the things that you've done wrong. 那么天父从来没有要定你所做错事的罪。And we will go and sin no more. 我们当然不再去犯罪。When we realize that the Father is not condemning us. 因为当我们发现到天父没有定我们的罪。So this it seems like an upside-down gospel. It is. 就好像我们所认同的那个所认知的福音好像不同啊。Oh, brother, you you're just licensing people to sin. 哇，弟兄，你很喜欢看人家犯罪哦，看弟兄们犯罪哦。No, I'm not. 不 ，I'm setting you free from the power of sin. 
Because it's knowing that my father doesn't condemn me. He doesn't want me to carry guilt, shame, and condemnation that I can go and sin no more. That he wants me to know that I am forgiven. I, I am a son. I, I am a son that walks forgiven. And when I mess up, my father is the first place that I want to run to. Because I know that my father is not going to condemn me. That my father is going to remind me of my identity and tell me, well, you're still a son. And he's going to say, son, I'm not accusing you. I'm not condemning you. You're still my son. Of whom I dearly love. Now off you go, go and sin no more. See, that, that's the gospel. That the Father is not condemning you. And there's people here this morning that you are carrying chains of condemnation and you're carrying chains of guilt and you're carrying shame, chains of shame around with you. Because the centrality of the cross is not the center of your life. I'm not talking about whether you're saved or not. I'm talking about are you free or not. Are you walking free from guilt? Are you walking free from shame? And are you walking free from condemnation? Because if you're not, then you are going to begin to punish yourself for something that was already punished for. And you are going to wonder why you spend your life in sickness. Amen? Amen. I, I, we're going to do something. As we're going to close. I, I know that there's a lot in there. But you are forgiven. That we as a body, I live under the waterfall of the forgiveness of the Father. That I am not going to do guilt, I am not going to do shame, and I am not going to do condemnation. And I'm not going to do it because I want to harness the power of God. Because the freer I walk, the more power that flows through my life. And, and it's His goodness that brings me to repentance. So here's a thought. See, what's repentance? See, if I'm teaching you about the goodness of the Father, and if repentance is changing our mind, and I teach you about the goodness of the Father, and you're sitting in church thinking, hmm, I never heard that. Wow, that sounds like a good Father. Yeah, I'm going to change the way I think about that now. You just repented. See, there should be repentance going on all over this room right now. Because repentance is not necessarily sorrow, it's changing the way that we think. That as I align myself to the goodness of the Father, I find myself repenting all day Every day. And, I, and I'm going I'm to ask you to do something that's a little hard. But if you can't do it, then perhaps it's all the more reason why you need to do it. Because if you can't do what I'm about to ask you to do, 
because of shame, then you've taken Jesus out of the picture. And you need to listen to this message again. Because Jesus died to your shame that you can walk free. That you can walk forgiven. And if you're here this morning and you would say, I, I know I'm not walking very free. I, I'm trapped in the grips of guilt. I'm trapped in the grips of shame and of condemnation. I, I feel like I'm failing to harness the power of God. It's fine for him to walk in it because he's free, but I'm not. This morning we're gonna get you set free. And without without a delay in this place. Without do not delay. If you know that you've got a chain that you're carrying around and that chain that chain is called guilt, shame, and condemnation, stand up right now. Stand up. Don't do shame. Because the Father is not condemning you and neither am I. Because my friend, it is time that we start living forgiven. I tell you, forgiven people love much. The more that, the more that you are forgiven, the more that you will love. And the, and the more that you are forgiven, the more powerful you will be. Because you become free. And who the Son sets free is free indeed. See, no, no one's going to lay hands on you this morning. No one's going to come to you and say, well, What did you do wrong? It's no one's business. This is between you and God. I, I, I want you to put your hands out in front of you like a cup. And I want you to ask the Father, What shame am I carrying? What guilt am I carrying? What, what condemnation am I carrying? And let him speak to you. We're going to close in just a minute. Let him speak to you. Those chains that you're dragging around of past lives, sins. See, I, I, I don't think the church should be sick. The, the Bible says, if any of you are sick, it doesn't say when you're sick. It's like sickness was a rarity. But today it's commonplace. And it's commonplace because we've taken the cross right out of the church. Well, somebody needs to pay for this. So I'm going to punish myself. And we wonder why cancer is rife in the church. Perhaps it's because we're not walking free because we don't know how forgiven we are. I, I want you to put in your hands whatever it is the Lord's showing you. Put in there the guilt. Put in there the shame. Put in there the condemnation. I, 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 I hope I'm not being culturally insensitive. That is not my heart. But I know that the Asian culture can be a very shame-based culture. My friends, it might be Asian culture, but it's not the kingdom culture. I'm not meaning to offend. 
我我不是要冒犯任何人。I I've just I've been around the Asian culture a lot, and I know that so many of you do that they do shame. 我我去过很多亚洲国家，很亚洲国家就文化就很多的，又觉得很羞的那种的文化里面。Let's begin to change that thing in Malaysia. 让让马来西亚开始改变这个。That we're not going to do shame. 我们不再有那个羞耻感。That we're going to start to walk and live free and live forgiven. 我们开始要活在自由里面，活在被饶恕赦免里面。Right? Do you have those things in your hands? 把所有的这些那些放在你手腕中。Your guilt, your shame, your condemnation. 你的内疚，你的定罪，你的羞耻。Your sin, your sickness. Your 疾病，你的那个疾病。And now I want you to pray with me. 我你我要你和我一起祷告。Repeat after me. 跟重复我的祷告。Father. 天父。Pray, let's pray that like you mean it. Father. 很认真的讲哦，天父。I thank you that at the cross. 我为了十字架来向你感恩。That you became my curse. 你成为担当了我的咒诅。That I can walk free. 使我能够走在自由里。That at the cross you didn't take just my sickness and my sin. 你的十字架不是只是担当我的罪和我的疾病。But you took my guilt, my shame, and my condemnation. 你担当了我的内疚、定罪跟羞耻感。And, and this morning I come to you afresh. 今天早上，我一个全新的人来到你面前。Not with a sin consciousness. 没有，不再以罪为中心。But I come to you with a righteousness consciousness. 而是以义为中心来到你面前。Knowing that you don't condemn me. 知道你不定我的罪。And I lay those things at the cross this morning. 我把这一切放在十字架面前。I I want you to put your hands out in front of you. 我要把你手伸向前面。Like like you're about to tip those things on the cross. 就像你要把把这些东西完全放在十字架的脚前。And tip your hands up the other way. 把它把手把它翻下来。Brush them off. Shake it off. 完全甩开甩开。And somebody give me a shout of freedom. 来呼喊自由。Come on, let's lift a shout of freedom. 呼喊自由。Who the sun sets free is free indeed. 神的儿子说，你得自由，你就真得自由了。We we we sang it this morning. I am free to run. 今天早上我可以自由的奔跑。I am free. I am free. 我得自由，我得自由。Somebody say freedom. 我自由。Thank you, Jesus. 谢谢耶稣。Amen. 我们热烈的掌声，谢谢我们的讲员 Crystal 牧师，也谢谢我们的吴牧师帮忙翻译。Let's thank our pastor and our interpreter this morning. 你们觉得会不会棒不棒呢 ？Do you think it's great? 太棒了，是不是 ？It's so great, right? 太多东西要去想了，是不是 ？So many things for us to ponder. 太多的思想要悔改了，对不对 ？So many things that we need to renew. 所以呢，我。坐在那一边的时候呢，我听了，我说哇，好多东西要去想哈。When I was sitting there, I was thinking that so many things that we need to rethink again. 所以我再一次鼓励你们说，他讲的东西，这本书里面大部分都有记载。So I just want to encourage you, whatever they have spoken is most of it are found in this book. 我真的是鼓励你们买这本书回去，你再读、再读、再读、再读的时候，你就可能会能够明白的更多。So I encourage you to buy this book. That as you read and read and read again, you'll be able to understand more. 这本书非常的扎实，非常的啊，有啊，就是有许多的见证，让你很容易明白。This book is so 呃，扎实。So 呃。This is just means solid, very solid, and there are so many testimonies in this book. So, I, I'm not selling flowers. You're not selling flowers. You are not selling flowers. You are right. You are right. You are not selling flowers. We are selling book. I am not promoting for the sake of promoting. This is. 真的，我说一个牧师呢，我我让这这本书帮助我明白很多。As a pastor, this book has helped me to understand even more. 所以我鼓励你买这本书。I encourage you to buy this book. 还有这个 CD. 
and the CD. It's because you need to listen and listen to for you to understand even more. Because I want to see his passion and the reformation of healing to be demonstrated among us. Can you say amen? You will see miracle happening. When you understand miracles will happen. Not to catch a principle. The once you understand miracles will happen. So amen. Say amen. Is that simple? Okay, you can go and get your refreshment. 